is there a surface disinfectant that actually works? Don't they all work? Uh, unbelievable number of them on the market, and that green line shows only a couple of them were working adequately, according to the standards set by Clinician's Report Track Division. Rella, what's different about those couple of products? Well, Gordon, that's a good question. Um, both of them are coming from Canada, and you can see that green line, if you look at the graph, is the log reduction of a test organism. And we should have, just by national convention, um, a three log reduction. And you see the long line is the good line, and you see a couple of products, BioSurf, Bag in a Box, and Germextra. Germextra. Can I get both of them? Well, Germextra is not EPA registered in the U.S. You can buy it in a lot of countries of the world, but not in the U.S. So what's in the U.S.? In the U.S. is everything else on that graph. Oh, but which one works? Well, the BioSurf, uh, come to find out, is a, a very unique product. Uh, we hadn't ever really worked uh, with these three other unique characteristics. Number one, it's unique because it... Um, uh, it has a very rapid and broad spectrum kill. Of what? In the presence of many different humid fluids, like um, fresh blood, uh, saliva, crevicular fluid, uh, pus, uh, the, the fluids that, that dental technicians and dental uh, staff, dental clinicians of all types uh, come in contact with all the time in aerosols, spills, uh, splatters, whatever. Now, because so many of them did not pass the test, uh, what tests are you using in uh, track research that would be different from what others are using? Well, we've actually performed all of the tests. In fact, we published a paper back in 1989 in JADA um, where we used the EPA uh, test methods. Uh, the truth is they don't really have a uh, a, a relevant uh, viral test method. And the thing that, that we have done that has been uh, uh, a problem for passing the disinfectants is that we always add fresh human whole blood. Mm -hmm. uh, if you were actually exposed to blood, you would be exposed to 100%. Uh, Every day. That, that's true. And so we feel that it's uh, um, a fairly reasonable test. It is fresh, it is human, and it's whole blood with all of the included uh, um, uh, inclusions that would include red cells, white cells, the clotting mechanism, uh, uh, the whole business. And this is what uh, causes a number of the disinfectants to flunk the test uh, because the actual whole blood elements um, neutralize the disinfectant. What is it about the special applicator that's different? Well, this, uh, this particular disinfectant actually has four unique characteristics. One is the fact that it's broad spectrum kill very rapidly in the presence of bio burden. Uh, the second is the fact that um, it has a very unique dispensing system. You'll notice uh, uh, a box and inside that box is a sealed bag. And um, this is actually uh, a process used to, uh, to deliver wine. Uh, people that buy wine at a grocery store, if they're not buying it in a bottle, they're likely to buy it in this kind of a decreasing, uh, collapsing bag in order to preserve from air uh, damage. And why do you have a special cloth to put it on? With? Well, that's become an issue uh, lately. Uh, a uh, number of experts in this area have noted that uh, the actual applicators that we happen to pick up uh, in a dental environment, like such as a paper towel or, or even uh, gauze wipes, where uh, the gauze has been bleached in order to make it look nice, uh, some of these chemicals and wood byproducts used uh, with the uh, uh, the paper towels actually interfere with the antimicrobial properties. Well, it sounds like we finally have something that works that we can get in the United States. You Canadians watching this have always had something. Well, to tell you the truth, Gordon, this is the first product that has uh, also been all portions of it biodegradable, and I, I think that's noteworthy too. Look into this new product. 
we're sure that it will do things that you could not do with the majority of the disinfectants that are currently on the market. Thanks. Thanks for being with us. Join us next week.